Okay, so today what I'd like to make is a, a Remembrance Day cross. And so here it is. It's uh, kind of a little uh, poppy in the middle and uh, a cross around the outside. Now this thing is very similar to my uh, two balloon flowers, okay? And so this thing in the middle, it's an octahedron. And so you can look those things up. Um, but anyway, it's very simple. Let's see what I can do. Well, I shouldn't say very simple. It's simple, but... So you're not going to use the entire balloon here because um, I need it to be a little bit smaller. Um, but the black one, try to use as much as you can to get 12 segments. Okay. And so I let a bit out and I tie it off. And so this is... Okay. So just like the flower, I want to make these... these uh, the thing that crosses in front, those little segments, I want to make them fairly small. Okay, now the square is going to be the outside of the, of the poppy. A little bit bigger. Okay, and so I tie this. There's the square. And now I pull the other one and I just, uh, I want to pull this around. And so this becomes, um, the bottom part of the cross here. Okay, so I need it a bit longer. Uh, and now I, it's important to match the length. Now, unfortunately, I can't quite tie this up right now. What I have to do is I have to make the other side of the cross. Okay, for another segment of the cross. And what you're trying to do is make it as symmetric as possible. Okay? So what I do is I'm going to across the square for the red, making these fairly small, and then I just bring that across like that, and then I tie it off with the original end. Okay, this is much like my flower. Okay, so what you have is six bubbles, but that's going to attach here. Okay, and so now I'm going to try to make another segment of the cross with one, a little guy, and then I have to match that other one. Okay, and so then I bring the red with a small bubble here around that one. Now I'm just finishing the octahedron. A little bubble here. Like that. Across the middle, and then another little bubble. And now finally I get to attach this part here. And so then I bring it around, and then I finish it off by bringing that to the knot. And then I pop the knot on the inside. Try to tuck it away. And so, that's what I end up with so far. And so now it's just a matter of finishing off the cross. Another one here. Another little guy. And then, finally, um, the last segment. And so, I get rid of this last little bit, uh, maybe, hmm, and then I pull that into a nice little knot, and then I tuck the knot on the inside, to hide it away. Okay. So, there's a little massaging that takes place, but essentially you're done. Now. You can use this end to maybe tie it to something, or you can just get rid of it, right? And then um, also uh, make a knot and then tuck that knot uh, inside the bit. So it's, you can't really see. And then essentially you can walk around like this. And so there you have it. Um, Remembrance Day cross balloons. Cheers.